first thing we need to do is to go to the RetroWatch system folder, create a folder called Mupen 64 Plus. Inside this folder, we are going to create two folders one called Cache and the other one called IRS IRS Texture. The cache folder is for the compressed textures, compressed files, and the uh, IRS texture is for the uncompressed textures. Let's start with the compressed textures. Grab some textures, whatever textures you want for your game from the internet. Then place it in the cache folder. Go to RetroWatch, load the game. Then press the F1 keyboard key. Scroll down to options. Glide N64. It's a Glide N64 textures only. It doesn't work with the other plugins. Then scroll down to use IRS textures. On. Then go back. Back. Close the core, load the game again, and the textures are loaded and ready. Now for the uncompressed textures, if you made your own textures or you downloaded some uncompressed textures, place them inside the IRAS underscore texture. Then open RetroWatch, load the game. Mario! Hello! And there you go. The textures are working. Now, if you go to the uh, cache file, you'll see that RetroArch compressed the textures automatically. And if you don't want RetroWatch to compress your textures, if you want to use uncompressed textures for whatever reason, go to the quick menu, then go to options, Glide N64, scroll down to IRS textures, textures, and disable use IRS texture cache compression. Now RetroWatch will not compress the textures automatically for you and that's it happy gaming